All right, well, let's see how this one goes. 96%. Apparently, that's not good enough. I mean, or is it good enough? I, it, it might be good enough at this point in time. It's, it's really hard to say. All right, but either way, I have done the requisite grinding off screen. So, you know, let's just do all the claiming rewards right now. Well, well, you're back with the creepy looking dolls. These are most definitely haunted, you know that? No, oh, whatever. It doesn't matter. Like, what does it mean? Does a, can a ghost be haunted by another ghost? That's the real question. I don't know if that's a real question. I mean, that's, that is a question that I have asked. You can see it in your eyes. Those eyes have seen things. Out of this world things. Deep in the abyss things. We're all ghosts here, you know. What does that even mean? Got a stream. And it's the finale for Spirit Fair. It better be the finale for, for Spirit Fair. I mean, I, can't, I cannot imagine like, like doing this game for another six hours or something. But even save some peace of mind. Take this. Just get out of my sight. I did it. Collection finished? Yeah, I mean, I guess you just get one, then you get four. Neato. All right. Oceans are now empty. What a treat you have brought me. The spirit fairer can't find a fish. She won't fish. You do realize that this house is the is the water. What? You take them from the... Yeah, uh, okay, yes. Uh, you take them from their ho own homes. For shame. Well, luckily for me and the fish, you can stop now. The collection is now complete. Not a moment too soon. Yep, I did it. Now... We go here we are again still going strong with the ingots. My hands are literally tied by my profession. Are they? I have to accept the trash you bring me. What is it now? Like a second stop screaming silently at the VODs. Oh, oh boy, now you can scream loudly at me for doing a very bad job with this game. Ah, whatever, we're almost done though. Finally, your pockets are full of ingots. We're gonna take them off before going swimming. Here's a little something to tell you that I care. Not about you, but the act of showing that I care. Twilight outfit. Okay. Now I think that's the last one. Mm -hmm. I'm a master chef now. You have cookbook in the stores now. What would it be mm -hmm. called? Stella the magical chef? Cook within the Avalite? Spirit faring your way to a decent weekday mm -hmm. meal? Mm -hmm. Those are all made up titles and they're copyrighted. So don't get any ideas now. Uh, it's been a wild dish centric ride. You barely mm -hmm. cooking, me doing an honest job. I won't miss our little talks about food. Well, mm -hmm. I did it. Mm -hmm. What do you want? Get on with it already. Oh, no. Like, no, like, no, no, nothing special. I mean, I've, I've, I've finished all the collections. <laughs> like, is there really no, like, nothing else? So I thought that we would at least have, like, a, 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 you know, something to say. Yeah, collector, complete all the collections. 6.3%. People gotten it. Well, uh, all right. <laughs> I didn't even get a percentage for that. Was that not actually re required for part of the percentages? Ah, oh, whatever. Maybe it was, but it only is like when I get at 99% or something. That was nothing. <laughs> okay. I I sort of expected to get like, I don't know, anything for doing that. I mean, I also ground out all the stuff required for this. And all the chests and whatever. And the, the, the upgraded all the whatevers. It's all pointless. <laughs> Look, we're just, we're just going to the end here. Oh, I need to get a blueprint to improve the room. Whatever. All right. So, here comes the question then. What else do I have to do? Uh, since I have spent a while doing the rest of... Oh, there's like side quests, right? Don't I need to do all the side quests? I spent a while doing like all the basic grinding and whatever. Crow's Ink Lost Bounty. Uh, yeah, there's this. Uh, there's also that. I don't know if it's going to require me to do all of the rest of the... All the rest of the, the, the side quests. I mean, I assume so. For pastoring with such mundane, need food. Okay, here, have a, have a sauerkraut. Okay. Oh, let's go do Jackie's thing here. See if he's even got anything that I uh, can do again right now. Eh, it's terrible. Yeah, whatever, Jackie. I don't really care. Yep, that's the one. Like more boring, good way. Zen, is that a word? Thanks a bunch. It'll assist you a little bit better with this. All right. So, you got nothing just yet. Probably going to be giving me another quest soon enough, I would say. 
Uh, at least I got all the basic stuff out of the way now. Just like literally going back and forth between some islands to go and complete some stuff. So, you know. Ingredients, great. Anyway. I just assume that for 100% I'm going to need to... Damn. Uh, I'm going to need to do all of the, the stuff. You know going to need to be going around. I'm going to need to like, get all the upgrades for the boat and whatever. Which is why I've already got most of them. Because, you know, it really is just like, hey, get a lot of money for some of them. Watch a stream and I feel fairly behind. Oh yeah, we're at the end of the game. This is the end of the game. Ah, dang it. No, can't really do too much with that. Can do this though. Spirit Farathon Day 6 was, what was it, six hours long? And we finished the game? And now I'm grinding out the last four percentage points to, to fully and completely finish the game. That's, that's really it. That's, that's kind of the entire thing. It's been so many hours of Spirit Fair, yeah. But I mean, it's almost over. I don't know. I think it's. I think the series was terrible. Oh, good job, me. I think the series has been terrible. So you know, I am okay with having to finish already. Man, like the the fact that the was apparently just like no. There's nothing for for finishing the collector. There was no like, hey, you did it. I'm. I don't need to be the collector anymore. Now fare my spirit to the, the, the spirit gate. Like really, you have oak logs for an hour. I feel like that's gotta be for what? Oh yeah, that was that was in one of the VODs. I mean, I do certainly have a lot of oak logs at this point in time, not that it really matters. It's all over, baby. We're almost there, right? All right. Let me see, 96%. No, it's still a 96%. Oh. Oh, good. Actually, uh, doing that, though. We got, um, you back in here. Get out of the way, corn. Stel, Stella, I did nothing wrong. Gosh, I blah, 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 lashed out at me. That if I didn't care for you. Pump them in smoke, dump them off the boat. The, the bees, shit. I'm doing it again, aren't I? It's Daria all over again. The bees didn't do anything wrong, and Daria. She's just Daria. I don't know why I get like that. Sometimes something happens, anything, big noise, something I don't like, somebody has a bad attitude, gets so, so overwhelming. You're like drowning, can't breathe, I can't sink, starts to red, uh, you gotta believe me, I just don't know how. I can do it myself, yeah, I'm a chump. Jack the loser, can't do anything right, always messing up, just, I need some time alone. I can't talk to you right now, got it. Uh, Why does Jackie have his own theme song? That's weird. Uh. I feel- I don't think anybody else has that. Anyway. Not quite. Ugh! Oh yeah, there's like still- there's another one of stupid bounty things. Um, I do not... know... where... that is. Got a bunch of onions to grow for money, and then didn't do that because, you know, I just sold all of the stuff I had in my inventory. Uh, what to do, what to do, um... Oh, right, uh, I do actually want to go up here and then see what we got for this. I really don't know where that is exactly. To the left of some sort of two islands on the border of something. So, like, the left one is larger than the right one, but they're both right next to each other. Oh, am I at the place? Yes. Okay, I guess I'm going to have to figure that one out. Now then, uh, in the meantime... What was I doing? I, I do not remember. I... was going to... Uh, I need to go get, like... Raspberries and whatever? I don't really remember. It's like berries. I need berries because I sold all my berries. Because you know, why would I need berries? What sort of reason would I possibly need berries? But I do. So, here we are. Drag continue. I'll go through this again. Uh, what am I doing? Um, 
Well, let's let's take a look at the map. I guess that's going to be probably the best way to do a lot of this sort of stuff. I still can't believe that there was really more of a, a like, you know, hey, you did it. You got all of the collections. Just nothing. Just like, eh, okay. Oh. Not even a, like, congratulations. You completed the collections. Now get out. No. Huh. I guess they weren't really expected to do all of that. <laughs> So there you go. More Spirit Fairy. We are we are 6% away from finishing this game, and I'm going to finish this game, even if it kills Stella. <laughs> Get it, because she dies. She's dead. Well, I mean, she dies by the end of the game, certainly. And the ending was disappointing! Anyway. So it looks like this, but there's not like a... Eh, well, it's not quite the, the same size of stuff. All right. Let me just look around. Yeah, sort of like this. Would it be about that? Stella! Hey, Stella! It's me, that guy from the streetcar named These Nuts. But, you know. I don't remember his name. It's played by a famous actor. Well, I do not remember the name. Um, <laughs> oh, man. Ugh. You're so close. We're so close to ending this game. I can taste it. And it tastes like ending this game. Marlon Brando, that's right. Only like early rolls. Or something. I don't really remember. Uh, anyway. I don't know. The second guy. I don't know if you saw the end of the game, but it was pretty disappointing. Anyway, uh... <laughs> Anyway, let's just continue on. Uh, I don't, you know, that's the thing. It's like, I don't think there's any way you can possibly, I, I thought about it, and I don't think there's any way you can possibly interpret this as like the, the spirit faring, the idea of being a spirit fairer and the idea of spirit faring being just total bullshit. Either this is some sort of personal afterlife for Stella, or it is, it is a dying dream, and both of them are not great. <laughs> Because it's like, both of them are just like, well, you know, the entire premise of the game, they're both fake. And I mean, it's, it's, oh, well, I just spoiled it for you. Anyway, uh, you know, it's just, it is just, man, I, I just, why, why, why do video games, well, here, let me tell you this. Video games, yet again, cannot resist making a big twist at the end that invalidates the rest of the story. <laughs> 13 Sentinel style. Because it is just. It just keeps happening over and over. Oh, man. Were there, were there were 65 identical Sentinels the entire time? Nah, if it, well, uh, specifically what the ending was that, I mean, if you're watching, it's this whole thing where it's just like, I don't really think it's spoilers if you're watching this right now because this is Spirit Farathon Day 7. <laughs> you know. Uh... But, uh, what, what was I saying? Yeah, yeah, Estelle's not actually dead. She's merely dying. This is, this is a representation of her sister. Uh, that is, that is sitting by her bedside right now. And the end of the game is that you throw yourself through the ever door. So it's just like, just, there's no, there's no spirit fairing. There's no spirit fairing. It was, it's all about Stella the entire time. And the problem is that Stella is a silent protagonist, so I don't really feel like having the entirety of the game's story based around a silent video game protagonist is very compelling. Yeah. <laughs> like, if I felt very strongly about Stella's journey to death, uh, into into death, what, however you would even describe that, maybe that would be different, but it's like Stella's a silent protagonist. How's that doing? I'm getting bloobs. I'm getting bloobs. Blueberries. Five identical spirit fairies alongside each other. I mean, it's just... It's just what it, it killed them just to make the ending, and then Stella becomes the spirit fairer. And it's good. And it's good. And we all... I mean, Stella is a very... And Stella, because she did it in her previous life, her living life, is a very good spirit fairer. The end. And she does a great job. It's just, because, 
Because I don't care about Stella finding peace or whatever. She's she's not even a character. She's a silent protagonist. And no personality. Anyway. Well, okay. There, that's me complaining about everything yet again. But I, you, you should expect that at this point in time. Frankly, it's frankly it's your fault. Should have called her Sharon. <laughs> no, because she, she's Stella because she becomes stars, like everybody else. See, you made the bad pun. <laughs> anyway. <sighs> it upsets me the bottom window of the bull dudes looks like a thong. Oh, yeah, I mean, it looks like it, 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 he does have a very T-shaped house. Big old T. But, like, I, I didn't have any other place to put it, and I'm not going to go rearrange all the, all the, the, the houses. Yeah, no, that's it. <laughs> I'm just, I'm not going to rearrange all the houses. You can't make me. You can try and make me, but you'll, you'll fail. I won't do it. Strawberries, etc. South, South Point. What's left? I don't. Like, there's one more character to throw out. It's it's Jackie, the jackass, and I'm going. And then I don't know. If I don't have 100% at that point in time, then I don't know. Not right. Is it not right? I mean, it does look. As though you know there is a uh, there is space for one more character and not and not and not Stella. Stella has well Stella doesn't, but but Lily, her sister, does have a th this character here does have a a thing that uh, like yeah. You know, let me just show here real, real quick. Yeah, you can see just like Lily is on the far right, uh, uh, second row far right, but there does seem to be space for one more, and it's not the. Until Stella's through? I already did that. I did that yesterday. That results in the, the credits. That's that's why I'm complaining about the uh, the ending. <laughs> because that was that was what we saw yesterday. I was really curious as to if they were going to have a big twist ending. And I mean, it's not really a big twist ending. It's actually a very, a very, very slow moving sort of, you know, entirely expected ending. But it is, it still does result in, once again, it still does result in... Uh, everything I did about spirit faring and whatever is all bullshit. <laughs> it doesn't matter and never mattered. Was Stella also dead? Oh yeah, I mean that was that was part of the game from the beginning. The twist was actually that Stella is not actually dead. She is merely dying right now. And that her her going through the, the Everdor is when she actually dies at the end of the game. Which means that this might have been a... Which, as I was saying, this means that that might have been that this is all just a dying dream. It could mean that uh, it was all just merely... Th that this is real, but, you know, the point was that Stella was supposed to make peace with death. And that me faring other spirits was just to help her along that journey. Which, who gives a shit? Stella is a silent protagonist. <laughs> but, you know. I can complain about that for more like a... Uh, a, a, a hundred more years. Well, in life, she was a a nurse who guide who who also you know assisted people as they were dying. So you know that's why that's why it's like you think she would be the spirit fairer, but she's not. It's about her dying instead, and she her own spirit is being ferried. Because fuck you. <laughs> Because fuck you, you are not the spirit fair, and you never were. And it's folly for you to even think that you could have been, possibly been uh, hold, held a, a, a candle to, uh, to Karen. <laughs> now go into the Everdor and die forever. <laughs> or become stars or whatever. Because fuck you. <laughs> it's very strange the other spirits would have to wait to pass on until Stella died. Well, did they? Or was this all just a dying dream that Stella's having before she actually dies? She's clearly going to become the Spirit Fair as the 100% ending. I've already had people tell me there is no 100% like special true ending. 
even if she is the spirit fairy, even if I am actually fairying spirits or whatever, Stella is being very irresponsible by not training anybody else or even telling anybody else to be the spirit fairy after this. Like, there is there is no way. There's no way to interpret this game as anything other than the spirit fairing is total bullshit and you're stupid for thinking that you were ever actually doing anything except for he helping Stella through her own death. <sighs> I'll stop complaining. I'll stop complaining. Meh. Doc, you are alive. I mean, yeah. And yet I'm playing a game about death. What does that say about me? I am kind of hoping. I mean, it's as we saw at the very beginning of the stream, I finished up the... The collections, you know, the stuff where you go and talk to one of the characters in the world, uh, Walrus, to see all of the things that you have to, well, collect in the game, whether it's like recipes or fishes, and I finished that. There was not even like a special line of dialogue or a cutscene, so I don't think there's going to be a one uh, anything that I get for 100%, aside from the fact that it will say 100% on the, on the screen. We can make this P5 part two. That's not, this game is still half as long as P5 and also was written significantly better <laughs> just in every single part. Just because it has a bad ending doesn't mean that everything else was bad. Come on now. Hey Stella, we need to have a talk. I'm not doing good, like not at all. I know I act tough and all, don't even think I've ever been doing good. Shit, you do get on my nerves sometimes. You can't have a collection game and do a rug pull. You told us to care. You made an NPC to have us care. Yeah. I mean, even in like a, a game like Donkey Kong 64, they at least play a little like monkey howling or whatever when you collect all the bananas in the level. <laughs> you get a little sound clip for that. Actually, the game ends with, uh, well, meh, maybe there is something. Maybe the game ends with um, this terrible blooper gag reel <laughs> if you get 100% in Donkey Kong 64. And that game's all about collecting. Anyway. I'm so happy or caring or just sparkly. I don't know how you do it. I've seen those people you care for. Hey, thank you, sir. Welcome back to me complaining about Spirit Fair. I'm sorry. <laughs> but I love you. I love you for the... Wow, 20, two years. Two years, eh? That's right. That means that you're here forever. It's okay. <laughs> I hate that it's... this. I hate that this is me apologizing for being bad at this video game. I've seen those people you care for. I know them because I care for them, too. I'm sure some of them are nice and all, but most of them are part of my language. Assholes. Nitpicky, demanding, rude. About you, everything seems to glide over you. Some Google yelling at you. Did I, I, I skipped right through that? Uh, just smile softly, gently, always. Yeah, that's what. That's. I I really appreciate how you're a total tabula rasa character that uh, that a player is supposed to project themselves onto. Anyway, then you magically fix the situation. Ah, uh, you're always the first to arrive and last to leave. Never heard you bad mouthing a patient or speak at all. As for me. Clearly never 100% it turns the blueprints for to rebuild humanity. <laughs> planet of the uh, planet of the statues of liberty all over again. It's I know what the blueprints were for. The blueprints were for the the blastomatics so that I uh, could delay it by like 10 minutes so you could actually complete the the hideout helm. I played I one I did 100% that. I had a lot of trouble playing the original Donkey Kong. I remember that was a big sticking point when I when I was playing that originally. Uh, anyway. Uh, I try to help sliding back into a dark place. Being angry all the time. Not a caretaker. Can't even take care of myself. Shove me into the Everdoor. <laughs> Wait, shove me into the Everdoor. Whatever. I'm on a fresh start, but I'm not sure a naked jail cell is the way to go. If I think of something, I'll go straight. To you, no games. Could give me some posters or something. Can't stay in concrete walls anymore. Really need them covered up. Feel like I'm getting cabin fever in here. Uh, make a girlfriend out of mashed potatoes right now. Motivational posters. Wow, like the class kind of motivational posters. You know the ones. Uh, hang in there, skeleton. Wow, a Dark Souls 2 reference in this game. That's... Uh... Arbitrary? <laughs> Clear glass sheet, iron ingots, and bronze sheet. Okay. Well, we still got like a bunch more other stuff to do. But let's go get the bronze sheet, I suppose. Glass sheet and then 100 ingots. I've played all of the Donkey Kongs. I can't believe that you would you would insinuate that I have not played every one of the Donkey Kong games. From Donkey Kong 1 
The Donkey Kong 2, the one where Mario is the villain. The Donkey Kong 3, the one with Stanley, the, the human character that everybody forgets about when they only talk about how there's like three humans that exist. The writing for the game is great. No, it's fine. It's, it's good. It's good. Ah, how many times do I have to say this? That it's like my, my issue with this game is I'm an asshole <laughs> and that the game is actually quite good. And that I am, um, I don't like the ending, but it's like, aside from that, to be honest, even that is like, come on. Play this game! Buy this game, everybody! If you think you'd like this game, you'd probably like this game. Go play it. Please don't, please don't listen to me. I'm, uh, I'm, I am wrong. <sighs> like, the game is not written badly or anything. No, don't take my complaining as saying this game is bad. It's good! I don't like it. That's it. That's the entire thing. I say this every single time people come in here. It's actually a good game. Uh. Oh, uh. It's a good game, everybody. I want to make that clear. There's one thing I've learned doing a lot of stuff, uh, playing video games for the internet. It's that my taste does not reflect the taste of everybody else, and I should be able to recognize quality even if it's in something I don't like. <laughs> <laughs> and I think that is reasonable, right? That's, that means that I can continue to complain about everything, right? Right? <laughs> That's how that works. Just do not take my complaining seriously. Yes, exactly. Oh, come on. I still do have Umbridge with the ending, though. Because the game being good is making you more upset. Yeah, I know, right? Because it's just like, I'm I'm clearly wrong <laughs> in what I'm saying. But, you know, I still don't want, I still don't like the game. <laughs> like, what do you want, what do you want me to say? Yes, the game is good. I do not like it. Hey, uh, yeah, that's the entire thing. The game is good. I do not like it, and it's make and it's and it's it's causing a crisis of conscience here because it makes it seem like the game is bad, but it's good. <laughs> that's why I deleted the the stream yesterday <laughs> because I'm just like I don't want I, I I don't like this. I hate this series. I'm doing a bad job with this series. <laughs> <sighs> oh no, not that. Um. All right, I should do that then. And then back to Jackie's stuff. If I can. There was also alcohol involved. I mean, I had like what? Oh, I didn't do bronze sheet. I think I did brass sheet. Ugh. I mean, yeah, I had a drink. I didn't even. I. I was. That, that was one singular drink. I wouldn't really say that I really went all out yesterday. <laughs> All right. There we are. As we were just as we were just trying to do some basic grinding to finish the game. But then I found out that I had a lot more grinding to do and I'm just like, oh, "I'm going to sleep." And then I went to sleep. And I can explain in more excruciating detail everything that I did, but I don't think anybody cares. I mean, I slept. I I suppose that's the excruciating detail. <laughs> Hasn't stopped faring. We're so close, and I'm back into the I'm back into the loop right now, where it's just like I'm like I hate this game, but it is a good game. Do play it though, but I hate this game. But really though, it is a good game, but I hate this game. But really though, play the game. But it's a good game, but I hate it. But it's good, but I hate it. But it's good, but I hate it. But it's good. <laughs> in in ad item. All right, I thought it would help, but yeah, it really doesn't. Need to hang in there, whatever that means. Certainly shouldn't be proud like a tiger. Tiger's even proud at all. Not a lack of pride is certainly the problem. I just, I'm, I'm selfish, that's what it is. You're thinking to myself, I act harshly and end up hurting people, hurting a lot of people, and hurting them bad. 
And then, even as I try to make it better, it's too late. The shit sell it, it sticks. You try to brush it away, you just wind up smearing it. Uh, you see, just stuck with it, nothing more. Old Jackie, don't think I can get over it. I really thought the posters would help, do not, they just make me feel terrible. But it might be good, maybe I deserve to feel terrible. What, don't make that face, I'm serious. Okay, I've got another idea, I need to focus on something else. You know, check out a Hotel Jackie just for a while. Thinking of a plan, but I'm pretty sure I just kill it. Uh, how about something that can't be killed? Maybe like a sand garden with rocks and stuff. Uh, kind of like meditation. Did you get me that? You keep loving games that are shite. It's time for the pendulum to swing the other game. What what games do I like that are bad? I love all good games. That's it. Except for the games that are not good. And games that are, are occasionally good. But I don't like them. Yeah, whatever. All right, what do I need now? I need silk fabric. Okay. Regardless, I did a lot of grinding before this stream started, so it won't be too much longer. And then... And then this will be but a, a memory of the past or whatever. You know, in that way. And I'll spirit this, this series to its death. <laughs> and it'll die. And that's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna shove this series in the soul hole. And then I'm gonna go and get like a, a Mountain Dew pitch black. <laughs> and I'll have a great time. I might actually go do that. They brought back Mountain Dew pitch black. I kinda feel like having that. Although I did say that I was gonna stop- Ah, dang it. That I, although I did say that I was gonna stop having like so much caffeine. Ah, it's probably fine, right? And now I'm in the game because I died and my soul's trapped here. And I'm being spirit fared, even though I don't still think that it's just like, yeah, the spirit faring is not a real thing. Once again, if a bonsai tree were giving the guy something he can't kill, they're notoriously fickle plants that seem to die if you look at them the wrong way. Maybe it's a fake one. Yeah, it's probably a fake one. Let's just say it's like a plastic thing. Stella, you gave me the thing, but I, I want to go to the, the Everdor now. I'm like, okay. <laughs> Neat. Ah, Stone Garden. Kind of surprised, actually. I didn't think you'd go through with it. Kind of silly, isn't it? Anyway, let's see what we're working with here. Right, it's got good color. Very fine. Has texture. Stones are very pleasant. A nice weight. Very stone-like. Even the wooden rake is probably pretty. Very soothing. My dad had a little sand garden in his office. Just like that, but smaller. I always wanted to play with it, but he didn't let me. I guess that's a real reason I asked him for one. Just to get back at him. But you know, he deserved it. The man, hell, he was, he was, he was okay. Shit. I'm doing it again. I'm lying for no reason. Mom and Pops are okay. They had their issues, I'm sure, but I'm not messed up because of them. No, that one's on me. I don't know why I kept, keep telling these tall tales. Like the one about my grandpa. Truth is, I barely knew him. I saw him once a year, and when I was old enough, he tried to teach me about bees. I was just a dumb teenager. I didn't care. And then he died. Now I'm a dumb adult who knows jack shit about bees. Guess I want to believe my childhood messed me up. Otherwise I have to own up to my own shitty behavior. Yeah, maybe that's who I am. Shitty and broken. Eh, that'd be fitting. Oh, uh, yeah. Thanks for guarding, Stella. I'll see ya. Got a... Got another request? What if I were to exit and come back into the game? 96%. Wow. These things. Uh, this is not gonna end. Uh. Well, maybe the the quest will be there. When, once I get back, it's not. I still don't know where the last one is. It's gonna finish today. Yeah, I guess. After six hours stream yesterday, I wasn't able to finish. Just kept going, you know. I don't know if I'm going to need more, like, bronze sheets or whatever, but we'll see. And let me tell you, we're definitely going to finish today because I did all of the... I did all of the various, um... Did all the various, like, grinding things ahead of time. So you don't have to watch me just endlessly make food or do fishing or find chests on the islands. I've gotten all of those now. They are... they are done. They are finished. They are... 
Could you start with picture and picture ads? I'll take that over regular ads. <laughs> That's fine. Clearly, the answer is that you should be uh should be subbed. No, don't say no. Anyway. Okay, strawberries for 15. Where is South Point Docks? I do not know where that is. I mean, what I should do is I should just start purposely running ads myself because that means that people don't. I cycled for three hours a day and haven't cycled in a long time. Now I have blisters on my ass. Any tips? Uh, do not. Uh, well, I mean, I, I guess. <sighs> Normally when I would get like blisters or any sort of like a uh, rubbing, you know, I would throw like um, uh, uh, some sort of lubricant, you know, like lube, like lube that you would use for sex. No, but like, uh, y you know, something on whatever, well, usually in between my thighs or something for that. I don't know if that would necessarily help for your ass. It sounds like you were just sitting on it for too long. Maybe try uh, uh, spacing it out a little bit better. That could help. Start streaming other hours, and when I'm asleep, I will absolutely sub. Well, unfortunately, I do have, you know, <laughs> I do have a job <laughs> most of the time, which does kind of prevent me from doing that. So it has to be spacing out my ass. Yeah, uh, what you need to do is you need to start gripping both sides of your ass cheeks and, and pulling them apart. <laughs> and once once your, your hips are, like, uh, three meters in, in diameter, then you know you've made it. I yeah, really just, really just like you know, really just get in there and then rip it right, up, right in half. Let it rip, as they say, as the kids say. Then I can reverse vor people. Actually, that's just called anal vor. It's uh, it's exactly what you think it is. There's a number of different vor types <laughs> that we can get into. <laughs> Am I gonna have to delete the stream again? Yes. I'll probably sub again and just a little bit short on money. Oh, don't worry about subbing, of course. Frankly, I want to turn off the off the ads. I just can't. Yeah, reverse war would be puking someone out, it's true. It's like you're still voring people if you are absorbing them with your ass. I mean not absorbing them, that's a different kind of vor. That's one that is just like, you know, I mean, I, I guess it's pretty self-explanatory, right? Anyway, um... Spirit Vor. I'm going to eat all these spirits. Look, look out. <laughs> I want this game to be over already. <laughs> I want this game to be over so that I stop playing this game. Yeah, no, it's like, what else am I going to say here? Yeah, do I have something else? I'm gonna put a sheep in there or something? I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Sheep corral, I need- oh, never mind. I wouldn't be able to do it anyway. Alright. Oh yeah, I guess I do actually have a sheep that's just kind of sleeping out here. Doesn't matter! Kind of finished up with everything, I think. We don't think it really makes too much of a difference. Oh yeah, I keep remember forgetting. I should be looking for South Point Docks, whatever that is. If it even is anything. All right, strawberry. Oh, ah, does feel. You made your own spirit gate. Yeah, go into the spirit gate that is a gaping. Asshole. I'm deleting the stream. <laughs> I've made the choice. I'm deleting the stream. I want this game to be over so I can stop playing it. I mean, that's what happens when you're contractually obligated to play video games. Yeah, no, that's it. Uh Look, it's like, what do you want from me? This game's been going on, um... Let me see here real quick. Game has been going on uh, 40 hours, 40 hours, 40.9 hours I just hit. So, you know, when doing that, and it's not done yet.
and then we can go and then it's like and I'm and it's like it's a bad series and I'm embarrassed it's a bad series and I'm embarrassed and I want to stop it already why don't you just stop playing the game never I have a contractual obligation I have a contractual obligation. Yes, I, I guess it's um f f 40 hours and 55 minutes or whatever. But you know what I'm saying here. I'll give it five more minutes. There. That's six more minutes, whatever. Doesn't matter. None of this matters. Much like being the spirit fair, none of this matters. Uh, but that's that's how it is Jackie, please let me throw you into the gigantic gaping asshole in my chat <laughs> So we can finish this. I'm deleting this VOD. I'm doing it. I'm gonna do it. I'm the VOD's being deleted Nah, I still have no idea where the uh, I don't know if I, I, I almost assuredly need to do Why it's so good yeah, this entire series has been so good. So good. It's been one of the top contents I've done. One of them. It's been the top content I've done. The greatest one I have ever accomplished. The one where I throw a game into a chat's collective asshole. Open up, chat. No, 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 not that mouth. <laughs> that's, that's the, this is what's happening in this stream. Oh. I hate this. I hate this place. Anyway, I hate this video game. I want it to be over. Open up your blistered asshole chat. Here comes the video game and then large and then loud squelching sounds happen And I'm talking like really loud squelching sounds People in the theater watching it are just kind of like looking at each other and trying to look anywhere but the screen I hate this Oh, please end this game Jackie, please. <laughs> okay, I'm eating chocolate ice cream here. <laughs> Tone down with the ass talk. Stop it with the ass play. Uh, anyway, South Point Docks. South, where, is, where is South Point Docks? Please, please, please. Because we can talk about something else here. No. No. South Point? I mean, it's south, right? I'm eating the sausages right now. Got any more? Uh, anybody else eating any other foods? Ah, oh, here we go. With ketchup and curry mustard. Ah, oh, okay. Vore up that ice cream. Oh, it's just so close. I'm so close to ending this game, but it's, it just, it feels like, it feels like a hundred years are still left in this game of solitude. Oh, unless. Well, Jackie, are you going to free me from my prison? Oh. Stella, I have something else to ask you. This might be the one thing I'm missing. You know, I never went to school. Well, I mean, I dropped out of high school. Maybe I'm not smart enough. Got all this energy. Don't know what to do with it because I was never taught. It's an easy problem to solve. I need to get smarter. Best way to do it with books. I didn't care when I was a teenager, didn't have the patience. Now that I'm a serious adult, I'm sure I can make it up super easy. Can you get some for me? Sure. What have you eaten since last stream? Uh, I had a coffee this morning. You know, tiny, tiny coffee, as, I, as I've been doing. Actually, no, it was a medium-sized coffee. It wasn't even a tiny coffee. I guess I gotta go fix that. Some of these. Oh, look at how big the ship is now. Now I got, like, all the stuff. All that matters. Two crystal glass sheet, one more pulsar ingot. He wants to read? No, he wants to go into the gigantic gaping asshole. I'm telling you, the asshole's calling him. 
Man, we have just... <laughs> I'm deleting this mod once again. Stella, I'm actually in the void yet again. Aren't you supposed to be extremely based and get uh, off coffee, cold turkey? I'm having tiny coffees. I'm not having, like, big coffees alongside, you know, energy drinks and sodas now. Do I want to be based? Is that something that I would even want? Let's be honest here. Okay. No. Weren't you supposed to stop being addicted to coffee? And it's like, yeah. <laughs> I guess. Okay, and then what was it? Uh, pulsar ingots. Read children what? Not reading any more books right now. I'm already doing this game. I refuse. If only addiction worked that way, indeed. I mean, it's coffee. I think I'm fine. <laughs> oh. Right. But fine, I can do that. Maybe I'll try in the next week. Read the novelization of Spirit Fair. This game is pretty much the novelization of Spirit Fair. It's more of like a visual novel than anything else. That's 40 hours long. Probably long spent a longer time with this game than I did with like 13 Sentinels, if you think about it. Think about it. Or don't. I don't know, whatever. All right, these ingots should be enough to smith out some books. I think. All right, Stella, I want you to throw me into the hole. Put me in the hole, Stella. I'm ready. Whoa, books, now I'm ready to soul. Hole. <laughs> sure takes me back. And I uh, turn out different if I stayed in school. When I dropped out, my parents kicked me out of the house. They, shit, they didn't kick me out. Not right away. I spent the next couple of years freeloading. Don't even remember what I did in all my time. Nothing, probably. They were pretty nice about it. But after a while, we started arguing. Like a lot and over nothing. And then I moved out. I was too proud. And we pretty much stopped talking. So I guess they didn't kick me out at all. And you know the rest of the story. I need a job. Hospital is understaffed, so they just hired anybody. What a shit decision that was. Eh, I better get these books. Thanks, Stella. Eh. Still not enough. Soon enough, though. Soon enough. You are going to... I'm going to welcome the embrace of the whole. It's got all the gameplay of a VN and all the sophisticated not, uh, collect, narrative charm of a collectible game. Okay, come on. It's a good game, once again. <laughs> don't, don't, don't say it's a bad game. Really. The red dude looks like he's going to commit multiple murder in a few seconds. Is that me? Is it me? You're talking about me? Um. I need strawberry. Oh, yeah, we're going to South Point Docks for more nonsense. Because I'm not. Telling you. Well, anyway, everybody only has three things they want in their house, so... I will... I, I guess th we gotta be getting to the end, is what I'm trying to say. You know what I'm talking about here. Oh. And then... Once again, we throw... We throw them into the hole and see if that gives me four more percentage points. It's all I need out of this game at this point in time. Four more percentage points. And then it's 100%, and then I'm done. Okay. Now then, who's the person I need to talk to here? Because we're doing the side quest, I think. I'm a bit busy. Are you the ones that, um... Okay, well, so he's not here. He's in the three, the the old central district. 
you know, it's going to be like 1%. I have tried to prepare for that as much as possible. I mean, we started out the stream finishing the collector earlier in the day. I got the rest of the chests that exist in the game. So, like, there's maybe... I'll central this. I mean, here, uh, one of the things I can do. I got my phone here. Um, I'm going to go look up, like, Buck's Quest, since I still don't really know where exactly that, um, that last... That last uh, uh, thing is that. So I'm just gonna look it up. I mean, why even bother? Right? <laughs> yes, why bother? Why bother? Because it's a good game? No, it is a good game. <laughs> I hate this crisis of, of good game versus bad game that I hate. Yes. Okay, let me take a look here. What are we doing? The exact locations. Here we go. 199, 167. Okay. It, it literally gives me... This wiki thing here literally gives me the... Um, the, like, coordinates to go to. So, I'll take it. Whatever works. Yeah, yeah. Truly. Looking people's in the eyes, acts of the souls. Okay, where else? Where else? I mean, they said that the person was supposed to be. Aren't those your coordinates? I don't know. <laughs> you know, just take a look here. 15 strawberries. Doctor in Overbrook. And Doctor for Overbrook in Old Central District. This is Old Central District. Good. No, okay. It's all the same thing. I don't know. I'm getting kind of like it, 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 trying to I, I'm getting I'm getting uh, all kinds of t twisted and turned around, y'all. Spend too much time trying to look forward to the end, not living in the moment or whatever. Truly, that's what this game is about. It's about uh, looking forward to the end too much, right? <laughs> anyway. Okay. Are you the one? Are you a doctor? Did you walk today? Nope. I actually spent time trying to get to the 100%. Or, well, I, I trying to do all of the side content of this game so that we could finish it up already. You're not finished yet? I actually spent like a couple hours doing like all the, the cooking and doing all the, the collecting and everything. By the way, when you actually finish the collect collections, there is no unique dialogue or anything at all. There's literally nothing. It's just like you just finish the collections and I guess you get an achievement on Steam. That was the that was the that was the height of what I got out of that. I also got all the chests, so you know. You the one? No. Who's the one that is the whole thing? Way to spoil it. Way to spoil what? Why weren't you here to start a stream? Mob right there. You're looking for a doctor? Okay, yeah, it's you. Hit me. Limbs only? Okay. Yes. Cool. I hope those add to your completion percent. I don't know. I really don't remember what it was at previously, but maybe, maybe it did. Okay. Oh. Maybe we can go throw Jack into the soul hole at this point in time. Which will be very near to the end. Stella. 
I'm, I'm in a bad way, Stella. I don't know how you can stand the side of me. I can't even stand myself. Books, I hate them. They're a load of apologetic bullshit. Say the same thing. Be the change you want to see in the world. Ask for forgiveness. There's always time to be better. Do you think I can get better? Do you think I deserve forgiveness? Yeah, sure. Yeah, I figured you'd say that. Uh, little doe-eyed Stella. You're smart, but you're an idiot. Mm -hmm. People don't change. Know why? All these books they say you can change by acting different. They're all looking forward to the future. But the future doesn't exist. I'm already dead. I've died already. I'm a dead person. A bag of lies to tell ourselves so we can be happy. Comic books. Here's forgive the villain. Join the team. Everything's good forever. For conveniently forget they raised the whole city. Genocidal maniacs, but that's okay. Yeah, Persona 5, in other words. <laughs> Real life ain't like that. Uh, people, they're made up of all the things they've done, good or bad. Same for everybody. Can't change your past, no matter how much you hate it. You just gotta own up to it. And what if you can't? Nothing. That's what. Listen, Zella, I'm sick of it. I give up. It was a fun ride. Actually, the shit. Just give me a holler when we get to the Avador. I'll get out of everyone's way. Okay, let's go. The depths of the pit. We did it, everybody. Uh, we'll see, at least. Jackie sounds like you, Doc. Do you feel seen? I am not an angry person, I'd like to say. I don't, I don't know. Do you think I'm like Jackie, chat? Do you think I'm a Jackie type of character? Am I? Don't, don't lol at me. <laughs> he doesn't seem angry, just depressed. Ah, uh, I did, might have missed the uh, earlier part of the story. Overwhelming and collective murder is all around us. That's the only thing any video game has ever taught me until now. Ah, uh, true. And it's like, frankly, they're the best character of the entire game. The murderer. <laughs> so think about that. Think about that. We love our mass murderers in Persona 5. Because they have the most personality and drive out of any one of the other characters. So we have to make them sympathetic now, right? We'll eat this VOD. Oh! Yeah. Get me out of here. Well, get Jackie out of here. And that, and that will be me getting out of here. We're gonna do it. I wonder if that will be the last 4% that I need, or if I need to really just go into all the tiny side quests and everything, too. I don't know! Dear from the beginning, the okay, the others have been pretty bad. Have they? I mean, I thought that they, they, like, the writing is still pretty good on every one of the characters. It's just, um... <laughs> I've, I've said my point! Right. I guess I probably should have taken the bus over there, but, uh, could I have? Yeah, bus is kind of far away regardless. Probably not as far away as what I'm doing right now, but still. Hey! Alright. Yeah, I actually found Jackie in, uh, the P5 cast have so much drive, they volunteer to change hearts without ever, ever, ever having their hands forced into doing it. Nope, never. <laughs> They're always so compassionate. They wouldn't need to be blackmailed three different times to actually do anything. They're, 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 they go out of their way to try and help every and anyone around them. They just certainly don't rely entirely on coincidence and and blackmail, yeah, to, to take any sort of action in the entirety of the game. No. Go out of their way to be the change they want to see. And that's what you gotta do, Jackie. You just gotta wait until somebody walks up to you on the street and says, Hey, Jackie, this is all you need to change your life. <laughs> I am good night to you all. Yes. Yes, it is a good night. It's actually like 3 p.m. here. But, you know. Maybe that's a good night. I don't know. I just took a nap. Because I woke up at like 6 a.m. today. You know? Early to bed, early to rise, right? It makes a man healthy, wealthy, and able to complain about Persona at a thousand words a minute. That's what I say. Central time twinsies, yeah. I mean, we also got, like, second guy in here, if he's even still in here. Uh, but, you know. 
got like absolutely yeah see we've got several people to see y'all yeah i mean we're, we're almost done anyway but i am gonna be deleting the, this vod because it's bad <laughs> talked a lot about vor again all right jackie hurry it up you better be worth six percent or four percent whichever one it is You know, at this point in time, I just kind of—I just realized I just kind of stopped feeding the people on the boat. <laughs> really hope whoever redeemed this thing is uh, Ego. I've been here for the past few streams. I remember when I finished the game, I asked, "It's like, are you sure you want me to finish the game still?" And like, yeah, yeah, do it though. And I'm like, really? You there? Oh, hey, Stella. It's time, huh? Clean up the place. Might as well leave the place tidy. I found this old suitcase, so I pack my stuff. I guess I don't need it anymore. Kind of feels silly. Well, I'll just leave it there. Ready to do this? Yep. Okay, I'll be in the tender. Also, I like that apparently uh, cleaning up meant they got rid of the television. Huh. Don't need this TV in my life. Or maybe pack that. It's kind of hard to say. Let's go. Is this 100%? I don't know. He took the TV with him. I'm gonna be in the stars. Watching TV. Hey, Stella. I know it's a bit late, but I want to thank you for taking care of me. You know, on the boat. Didn't deserve it. Maybe that's the difference between you and me. You didn't care about that. You don't judge. I'm a blank slate protagonist. I don't care about anything. Uh, I don't want to sound mean, but you're simple like that. See if people need help and help them. No questions asked. No payment accepted. You gave me the obel. That's just how you are. Still saying 96% afterwards. Oh my god, that is... That is... Absurd. I, I can't even imagine that. But then again, it's like, didn't when, when I got Daria, Daria was 1% and it took like... And, and how... And I did like several platforming... And everything. Several platforming sections and everything like that. I'm not trying to make excuses, but... Never seen my bosses, not once. There's an endless parade of supervisors and managers. I have a box of donut for the night staff on New Year's Eve. There was a book, you know, in the books he gave me. It was about uh, myths and stuff, like old ass stories. One of the book's chapters was about the afterlife, and that's what this is. Things that happen after people die. One of the stories, there was a river, and if you drank from it, you'd forget everything from your life. Just like Blaint Slate. Yep, that's what I did. <laughs> Poof, like that. Ain't that crazy? And there's the other place, with a weird name, like Shoal? Something like that. It's like hell, except not really. No fire and pitchforks. Once our dead folks go, not just the bad ones, everybody. And in Shoal, remember everybody's equal. There's no comfort. Doesn't mean that it's uncomfortable, there's just nothing. Nothing good, nothing bad. You shield it from light and from judgment. And that go there to be forgotten by the living. I also forget and turn to dust. Until there's nothing left, there's dust and forgetfulness everywhere and forever. <laughs> Can you imagine that, Stella? Dust and forgetfulness. What a thought. Yep, and if you got the negative, it'll lead into the dark room. Yeah, okay. We're there. I, uh, just... Yeah, just bring it in. See on the other side, Stellas. Why not? I mean, you're already here, my dude. <laughs> See you on the other, other side. <laughs> In the after, afterlife. Also, Stella, I was really into Vor. All right, Vor me up, Sky. I sure do love being in the belly of the cosmos. It's very erotic, Stella. <laughs> oh, 
All right. How are we doing? Is that 100%? Please. Fuck off. <laughs> Fuck you. Oh. Fuck. <sighs> Couldn't we end on Vor? <laughs> 2%! I know. Why? It's like, what, <laughs> what is this? When, uh, when you get the 100% achievement, do a pose and make a quip like Sonic or Raz. You know, the two quippiest games out, out there. Uh, yeah, I, I, do, I, do like the, I do like the double peace signs, and I'm like, I sure do love Vor, Stella! <laughs> That's what I do. Unfortunately, we didn't get there. <laughs> You fool! The idea that you would think that you would get 100% by shoving everybody into the war gate. Idiot! That's not how that works. Just like Nixon. Did Nixon do the double piece and then talk about how much he loved Vor? YouTube crowd is gonna be really confused. Yeah, well, I don't think the YouTube crowd is watching this. Um, okay, uh. No. Oh. Oh, almost gave me a bunch of letters. I know I've been, I feel bad, Terry, I'm, just, I'm sorry. Dear Darla, Daria, if you're reading this, I'm currently reading a book to deal with my anger issues. It says first step is ask for forgiveness. No, it sounds stupid, but could you forgive me or whatever? I don't know. Forgot to is greetings from Forgala. It's me, Jackie. Experience the one that's, this is not even from Jackie. Um, here we are. Hey, Daria, what's up? I already been doing Stella. Da, 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 da. And then he got on a helicopter and left. <laughs> left to the afterlife. Oh, what, what is this now? Hey, it's me, Buck. I should probably go into the soul gate now, eh? Look, I have something to tell you. Now there are only two of us in here. You might have guessed it already, but I can't really go through the Avidol. It's really hard to explain. My guess would be that I've already been through it. I don't know. In a weird, strange way. See what I mean? Sorry to break it to you, but uh, I don't think there's more to it. There's you, me, us, this world. Listen, I don't really want to push you towards it. Crack no. But, you know, I think you uh, accept your fate. Give it a try. Not really for a give a lesson, but I don't even know if I myself expected it. My presence here might give us a clue. That being said, if you say I'll try to entertain you to the best of my abilities, not much I can do, you know. As if I were somewhat limited. An invisible barrier existed in me, too. Can not feel it, you know? Sorry, Commander. I'm really sorry. What does that mean? Did talking to you give me another percentage? No. <laughs> <sighs> so, should I... Should I go back to the Soul Gate? Maybe that's what I... I mean... Whatever. Buck, go to... Yeah, that's just that again. Well, maybe I'll... Ch maybe I'll do it again, and I'll see if there's a different ending where it's not all a dream. <laughs> but I know... I've already been told that there's not. <laughs> Ugh. Oh, on. Look, Stella, I'm here, but I can't leave. It's kind of stupid in that way. I don't know why. Accept your fate. Maybe I'll go through the door and it'll be like, yeah, you, you know. You are actually the spirit fair. What's the other quest? That's Buck's other thing. He's, he, he gives you apparently si other side quests. What? Thrush is once again saying some message every side, side adventure, he does stuff. <laughs> I mean, I got like, yeah, like Buck gives you random quests. Uh, Stella, this is the end game thing. I guess there's this. Didn't actually finish this one yet. There's also a couple more of the side quests. Of which I'm pretty close to finishing them, but you know. 
I don't know if that's quite good enough. Maybe I'll go start prepping those up just in case that's what's going to be required. Because there's a good chance that might be what's going to be required. I don't know. God. 2% left. Surely it cannot take too long, right? Surely. Surely we are pretty much already there. What a... Can I not do this while I'm in the Everdoor? Yeah, I guess not. Whatever. Come on, Stella, we're doing it. Again. <laughs> we're going right back into it. From this point on, where do you want to... All these people telling me about how they were into Vor. Little do they know that I, Stella, was also super into Vor. Maybe even more than the rest of them. I spent my entire life, you know, going to, 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 to conventions. I had my own persona called Big Bertha. And I wore, like, mascot costumes where I would eat other people. Like that one video you've probably seen of that mascot eating a person. I would draw my own art. I would get commissioned to draw art for people. And they didn't know. They didn't know that it was me the entire time. We probably met many times on the internet boards. Talking about Vor, talking about how much we all loved Vor. And yet at the same time, even in the last moments, when I brought them to the Everdor, they had no idea that I was actually one of the preeminent Vor enthusiasts of the entire world. Perhaps this is a tragedy. Perhaps this was the way that it was meant to be. Either way, as the spirit fair, I feel like I have done my job, even though I am somewhat remiss about not telling them about my Vor stuff. Now it is time for me to be void by the universe by going through the Evervore. Which is what I'm going to christen it as the Spirit Fair now. When people look up in the sky, they will see my constellation, which is a gigantic mouth eating the rest of the other stars. And they will know that I truly was the scion of Voring in a way that might have been subtle, but it still happened. Don't smile because it happened. Cry because it's Vor. be funny if this game went above 100%. I hope not. Anyway, uh, that is... Okay, I did it again. Wait, why does the kitty die? Is the kitty a spirit too? I... The, the cat barely factored into the game at all. But also, the other thing is that, um... You know, probably. The, the cat's probably been dead the entire time. I mean, I hope to God that I get the, that it's 100% now, because, um, you know, <laughs> that's the canonical ending as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> like, come on! What more would there be to do? 
Yes, but did the cat die with Stella? No, the cat probably died a long time ago. I don't know if you've noticed this, but the entire game has been Stella's memories of other people and places. That's like that's like kind of the uh, the entire thing. Even though again that the cat came to Karen with Stella. Yeah, well, so did a lot of people. A lot of these people probably died a significant time before Stella did, especially considering Stella just died literally right now, right now, right now. And the cat was absorbed into Stella's being, becoming part of the same constellation. It's the Circle of Vore. Circle of Vore is a big mouth. Alright, so, yeah, please tell me that is 100%. Kind of feels like the cat was soulbound. I mean, all these people seem to be soulbound. And that's, you know, provided that they're e that these are even the real people here and not just, like, Stella's memories of it because it's a dying dream. But, you know, that's how that is. Can't skip past this, by the way. I'd like to. I'm guessing there's some dumb fetch quest. I mean, that's sort of what Buck's entire thing is. If it's Circle of War, it consumes us all. Uh, but... It seems like a wholesome game. I mean... If that hole is a mouth, yes. I mean, probably. We also call people that are fans of them Thunderlings, which I don't like. I don't, I'm not, I'm not a Thunderling. I'm a Firebird. Uh, Professor Thunderwaterbird is a totally different entity. All right, please. Fuck you. <laughs> okay, they lied to me. That wasn't the end. Oh my god! Ugh. I mean, I, I had already finished the game at that point in time, you know? I had already finished the game, so, you know. And besides, that is like the ending, and there, were no, there was no new ending because I got everything. No, I don't think there's any new ending. I think that's just the ending. The ending is, fuck you, the spirit fairing doesn't matter. <laughs> Vor. My addition about Vor is is more meaningful than, than <laughs> the actual <laughs> real ending of the game. It gave more personality to Stella. I, 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 I submit to you that that should be made canonical. Uh, Thunder Lotus, get back to me here. <laughs> Tell me. Oh. Finish up side quest then. Yeah, I mean, I guess. Wandering merchant. Yeah, it's clearly Francis. It's kind of the only one it could be, right? 98% everybody. And I gotta get an A plus here. This is a 100% guide. Ah, uh, it's whatever. Like it's just gonna be doing the side quest, right? I mean, that's like that's gotta be. Like, I feel like I'm just gonna do the side quest, and then it's like, yeah, it's, you know, one on one percent. Oh, that's not what But, I suppose we're gonna go. Until the spods are spirit fared. I mean, I guess I can see what it says, but unfortunately one of the problems that might happen is that the stream will go down. Alright. Well, this is a 100- this is 100% achievements guide, not 100%. That's not the same thing.
So, I don't know. No, am I here? Why do we else do have uh alright, alright. I mean where 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 was I going again? No, let's go get the uh, yeah, I need more strawberries, right? Ugh. It's one hundred percent achievements guide. It's totally different. There is like a missable achievement and everything. I assume that's not counting in uh one hundred percent because that would be exceptionally cruel. Like, I wasn't told 100% achievements, I was told 100% completion, which I assume is just, you know, the thing. Strawberries, what is it, Celeste would not? That's right, Celeste invented strawberries. They didn't exist until Celeste came around. We can all thank Maddie Thorson for that. Think about it. Oh my god. And so it's been an hour and a half, and we still haven't finished the game. And this is after I spent a long time grinding out all the... Ugh, what now? Oh, this guy's here. Ah, uh, yes. Merry adventure, need to get into character... Whatever. Yeah, great. Okay. Now, what's the dumb thing? Uh, sunflower oil and other oil. Uh, cool. Burnt food? Questionable meal? Old shoe? Why not have any old shoe? Uh, questionable meal. Um. Can't go 100% until you come to terms with death, which the game defines as liking the game and leaving a positive review. I knew it. I knew it was gonna be that. I didn't. That's dumb. Questionable meal? Burnt food? I don't know how to get burnt food. Again, if you just like cook something that doesn't work together, I know that's how you get questionable meal. Which I sold all of them already, so you know. Um. I hate this. I hate this a lot. I hate that I'm not done with this game yet. Why is this game not, not done yet? Somebody answer me right now. Why is this game continuing? Ugh. Uh, what am I doing here? What am I doing? I'm just looking up this. I don't know how to do. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Just cook a fat by itself? Sure. Do the last upgrade. Oh, there is the That's true. The last upgrade might actually be the last 2%, thinking about it. Because it's like, that is that is sort of a major thing that isn't just like, you know, rando side quest type of thing. Although I am going to look up real quick. How do I get, um... How do I get burnt food? Apparently, you gotta wait a very long time. Is it a request? Uh, re upgrades are in the request tab. Or, like, the well, the quest tab. I don't know if it's necessarily considered a request request, but we'll see. I do need to do this, though, first. Because I already used some of that on, like, Francis. Not Francis, the other guy. Whatever that guy's name is. There we go. All right, there's that then. Let's go to that because apparently getting burnt food takes uh, some time. All right, liking the game and leaving a positive review on Steam. That wouldn't surprise me if there's some game that has tried to do that, you know? 10 pink moonflower seeds. Wow, that's a near, that's a, that's a reference to the most obnoxious quest in the entirety of the first near game. <laughs> That's a weird poll. Sure. 
Oh. That was very specific. Okay, what do you got? Oh, well, I mean, I know what you got. You got this. It's nothing. It's extremely pornographic food. I mean, I cook like this rice or whatever. I didn't even know that you could burn stuff. Why is that even a thing in this game? But, uh, anyway. Yep. And then they just leave Buck here with you. Because, like, I don't know, I've already gone through the door or whatever before. Is that even a thing? Is that a thing you can do? Apparently. Why not? But, yeah, here we go. Uh, that's, yeah, I even have all the XP potions, which is kind of the one that was really taking some time to do. Captain's log is requests. I mean, requests you can obviously see are the main stuff. Upgrades, though, and shenanigans are things that are like side quests, sort of, but maybe? Who knows? As it is, um... I don't know. And I, ah. Ah. <sighs> Yeah, but there, did you enjoy the end to Spirit Fair? We got to see it a second time. Did that make the entire 40 hour journey better or worse? Uh, I made it worse for me. Uh, I feel like I would have just preferred if it was just a, a thing. The kitty kitty hug looked nice. I can do that. It, 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 Yo, I don't know if you can do know this, but I, I can I can like hug the cat at any point in time. I can do that whenever. I mean, it's like it's it's just it's it's an on command animation in the game. I just don't because I don't care. The cat basically played no role in the entirety of the game aside from being here. I want forty hours of this. My cat does not like being hugged. I don't I think most cats don't, right? <laughs> uh Well, I guess I'm gonna sleep because that'll waste time. What forty hours of just this? Of, of what me complaining over a, a cat being hugged? I could probably do that, sure. Okay, gotta go get more strawberries, gotta go do stuff, there's just so many things. I hate it. Then we're gonna end. This game continues, this game endures. Regardless of how much I want it to or not. Just a hat cat hug, your input on the hug is unneeded. Okay, I'll well, just... Alright, um... Get to a place where we're not gonna interact with something. No, it's just cat hug. Oh, I'm here though. All right. Ugh. Played this game for 40 hours. Is this not considered a positive review? Yep. Very, very good. It's not. I lied. I hate you. I did it. I did all the stuff. And nothing. Just, like, nothing at all. Like, not even an acknowledgement of the, the, the boat underscore complete underscore string. <laughs> and that's it. It's, like, nothing. <sighs> and that gave me nothing. There you go. That's a spirit fair for you, everybody. They tell you to complete things, and then they don't give you anything for completing things. It's pretty great. I love it. I, I don't. I hate it. <sighs> Maybe it gave you less than 1%. It's hard to... It's like... A, a impossible to say. Because it looks like 98%. They should have fractions of percentages if they're going to do that in the game. I don't know. But, uh... Well... I'm gonna burn this rice in the desperate hopes that it does something. Yeah, who knows? Maybe it will. Maybe it won't. Maybe it definitely won't. Alright. 
I'll hug the cat though, because that's that's what people are here for. They're here for for sick cat hugging action. Uh, let me see. Well, I got an eleven percent of people got this achievement for getting all the figureheads. Is that something? And that's every achievement, baby. Well, it's one of them. Yes. Did I want to even come here? Um, what am I doing? I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just kind of like doing stuff for the sake of doing stuff. Back to the bus stop. Always back to the bus stop. So, I, I alright, so, here's the thing. At this point in time, we got no, this is nothing. There, there's nothing left in this game. We're just still, uh, there, there are unexplored areas, it's true. But, like, not much. I feel like, I feel like they are the inky blackness of the edges of Stella's memories and like this sort of stuff. But, like, yeah, mostly just this. I guess I could go look around, but I, I've sort of found, like, all the ones that feel like they would be relevant. You know, like the, the... The hidden shrines and whatnot. So, I don't know if it's important. Completing the map is the last one percent. You don't know that. God, this is this is some dire content here on twitchtv slash Firebird. <laughs> and I'm gonna try my best, but like, oh boy, this the vod is still getting deleted immediately. As I'm sure you probably already guessed. Alright. Sure, there is a quest up here. And, uh, oh, there's a spirit flower up there. I wonder if getting that... Yeah, I guess I never actually got Daria's spirit flower because, you know, whatever. But, yeah, uh, yeah, she doesn't have a house. So it means a lot. Yeah, whatever. Mm hmm. Cool and poggers. So, that one's done. I tell you this, but this is great content. Easy though! Yay. We did it. We got french fries, and tomorrow's our muesli. Oh boy. <laughs> french fries are good. I don't care. We actually fixed up the, the thing to give you a bunch of uh, french fries. That's right. You did that entire side quest, and now you can get french fries. This is the life that we lead here, or the unlife, because we're all dead in, in the world of Spirit Pharaoh. This is. Oh, this is the worst content. This is, this is, this is bad content. This is like, this is like Horizon. This is like Betrayer. This is Elden Ring content. Anyway, give this to me. I did it. I got a spirit flower. Is that enough? What if I just need to collect that one spirit flower? That's technically part of one of the, nope. <laughs> no idiot. That does, that counts for nothing. And you're dumb for even thinking that. Look at this dumb idiot. He thought he was going to get two percentages by picking a flower. That's not how that works. How is this like Elden Ring? It's bad. <laughs> it's bad content for a good game. <laughs> That's how this is like Elden Ring. Consider that. Uh... Let me see here. Why? What I need to? Um, what? Are, what are the other quests that I could do for Buck? Yeah. He's also got like one more thing. Edgeboro, do the thing. There's one where I gotta go back to Edgeboro. The you don't like the game? Nah. That's just I, the, once again the game is good, but I don't like it. But yeah, that's just how that is. <sighs> Why is there an exclamation mark on the map? That means that like the the uh. Or I planted on this turtle's back uh, is is complete. I can go and get more of it if I want to. Yeah, once again, good game. I do not like it. Good game. I don't like it. There you go. That's, that's that's kind of the entire thing. Good game. Play this game. Play this game. It's a good game. I don't like it. It's a good game though. One ninety nine. One sixty seven. Gotta make it very clear that it's just like, this is a good game. 167. Oh, it's that thing up there. Okay. Yeah, I guess I can see. That's, hmm. 
Octopus dies to black turnip and my arm is tired, but I have two more turnips to go. Uh, they start gaping your asshole again. <laughs> Trust me, it'll work. I need more berries. <laughs> uh, okay, okay. How's the how's the food stuff doing? Has it transformed into bad food yet? It has not. One, this is a good game. <laughs> yes. Two, do you like it? No. <laughs> any well, any other questions? I'm giving my TED talk on this game here, on the game vis-a-vis -vis quality, and of course, quality and um, you know, uh, uh enjoyment. <laughs> Quality high, enjoyment low. I'll I'll be here all day apparently. So any any questions that you might have on Spirit Fairer, you made all recipes. I did, I did all the stuff for um for the collection thing. So you know, if it was in the, if it was in the 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 collectors. So it's just like yeah, like you. Susan's museum is entirely complete. There was no additional dialogue or anything to be said. That includes fish, that includes recipes, that includes everything. It's all there, baby. Come on, start burning already. Mmm, take a big sniff. Said <laughs> this is this is what I'm at right now. <laughs> Imagine the smell. It was burning rice. <laughs> I, 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 uh, it's still going. This game is still going. Had all. Oh, I have. I have the achievement for all. I have the achievement right now for uh, having every one of the sheep. All the sheep are done. Off screen, I got every one of the. Off screen, I got every one of the recipes, every one of the fish, every one of the chests. Uh, I got the sheep. I filled out, you know, everything about everything. Five old shoes and oak logs. Yeah, and you did the thing. All right. <laughs> um. Maybe the shenanigans? No, it's still 98%. Maybe the shenanigans are holding you back? Uh, there's only... I mean, I can go look up, like, if there's any more shenanigans that I happened to be missing or something. That is a possibility. Side quest style. And then I'm just missing some side quests. Uh, let's take a look. Anyway, let's look, look at the shenanigans. Billing, Francis. Mail, got that, got that. Already got that. Got those. Let's clear out the black triangle. No! If that's... If that is the, if that is the, look, I'll do some sort of fall. I'll be, I'll, you can like do some sort of punishment game on me or whatever. For some reason, that black triangle is the last thing. There's no way. All right, got this one. Wait, did I get this one? I don't think I got this one. No, you see a little fishing. Dr. Simon and Furugawa. Oh, that might be one. <sighs> Wouldn't have to you doing the fine job punishing yourself. I don't know. I like to gamify um, me being obstinate. <laughs> so. <laughs> if you've got something you want me to do. I mean, you're going to lose anyway. It doesn't really matter, but still. No, am I here? I think I might be here. We noticed. I mean, you can see I'm playing a video game, and it is my punishment because I allowed you to... <laughs> see? I allowed you to let me... to choose my video games. 
Maybe you're missing the two nuts. Maybe I am. Maybe I just need these nuts. Uh, but anyway, yeah, it's like, see, by allowing you to choose the games I play, I am punished. Frankly, it's my fault for trusting you, chat, the entire time. Think about that. Think about that. But it's like, if I just never let you... Maybe what I should do is I should just get rid of all the rest of the games on the list and never ask for requests again. Because <laughs> clearly that's the issue, right? Just go do it like a normal YouTube channel where they're just like, I don't care what you want me to play. I'm mean, I refuse. How about that? How much money to play Minecraft Dungeons? I already played Minecraft. Did you like the Minecraft playthrough? Plus, Minecraft Dungeons isn't too bad, is it? It's like, a, it's like one of those action RPGs. Anyway, 50 subs, <laughs> as always. If you buy 50 subscriptions to my internet, internet channel, I will me let, play whatever game you want. Oh, you hate channel growth, so of course you like this. Says Yo, who wants me to play, what, with Ratchet and Clank right now? Uh, if I love channel growth, you'd be playing these old PS2 mascot games. See, now's the point in time where we got into the... Where, where, where we're now, like, fighting with each other. Me, 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 chat and I, uh, it's like, we, 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 are, we are at each other's throats. Alright, there's a character named, like, Simon or something I gotta talk to. Are you a Simon? No. Um... Diablo. Yeah, like, action RPG, like that sort of thing. Where's my brother? He should be here. Maybe that's the one I was looking for. Anyway, as it is, I suppose I'll continue to look at every one of the... Wait a second, is that like a chest? Why am I not able to get in here? I probably got it already. Given that, you know... Oh, four god doors, you say. Alright, we'll begin. Um... Didn't say my suggestions were for channel growth. Well, why are they not for channel growth then? No. Keep mashing this here. Then why are you talking about channel growth if you if you if you hate channel growth so much? Because I want games I like. Why don't you want games that are good for growth? Because you're the one who's telling me about growth here. Oh, yeah. Uh, was that it? Was that the entire thing? Yeah, sure. Poggers. Anyway, uh... That does seem to be like a, a quest or something. I don't know. You got nothing. Here's this. Uh, hi. You have a quest? Cool. Well, I mean, maybe that's like a thing I was missing. I don't know. I can't read a dialogue that fast. I can't read it at all because I'm 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 blinded by rage. All I care about is finishing the game at this point in time. It continues to endure, and I hate it. Well, I guess I never got this chest. Hmm. Whatever, linen seed and gleam bottles. <sighs> Whatever. I'm dumb and I don't want it. Anyway, get me out of here. I want to have to argue with chat more. Chat, you don't deserve to read this dialogue. That's what it is. Still not. I mean, it's, it's, the, the smoke should start turning black or whatever by the time I do the thing. Just gotta keep going here. Now my red chest. Now worth it is not. I'm gonna save the game. Did it? Did getting that chest do anything? No, it's still ninety-eight percent. Yeah. I got a fish. Got a fish for notes so I can do bad side quests that I hate. Is this it? It is. There's a message in a bottle. You gotta rub me the right way. 5811. Okay. 
Wait, isn't that where I'm at right now? No. It was negative 58. And... Hello. There you go. I'm just gonna go rescue this dumb idiot, and then I'm gonna go and finish my uh, finish the game. I don't want to. Three sandfish, yes. What? <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Um, this is sandfish. All right. Uh, what are we looking at here. Um. No, it's 58, negative 11. Did I do that right? I think I went to negative 50. Negative 58 or something. Yeah, okay. Let me look at that again. It's 58, negative 11. Okay, so I did it wrong. I did the wrong negatives. Oh, it's actually right here. There you go, everybody. I did it. I did it the right way. I saw the big question mark. I'm gonna go rescue this giant question mark. Near reference, I'm running on fumes too. Yeah, fair enough. How are you feeling, by the way? I kept, I kept, did, did I haven't actually talked to the... Talked to the... Did, did, uh, sent to sent message recently. Been too busy satisfactoring and now trying desperately to get through this game, which is never going to end. It's never gonna end. That's how it works. You just like. It's not a website. Is Dr. Infernal Firebird still playing Spirit Fair? And the answer is yes. Yep. <laughs> it's a dozen. No, no. Arm go alley, arm hurt. Yes. Look at how big the ship is when you have it fully upgraded. Big, isn't it? Oh. You're gonna tie a big block of nothing. And that's what I did. My block ship. I love my block ship. My favorite. I'm going Betty Bye until I maybe, and then when I wake up, I have two more percentage underneath the pillows. And that's uh, all we can hope for, really. I mean, that's the only thing. It's that's what's happening. We're almost there. No. God, it's taking so long. I don't even have any like. It's just like, is this is this like even a thing? I don't know. We got the blood water though. That's pretty poggers. I'm pogging over here. Yep. Anybody extremely turnip pilled and tuber celled in the vegetable arc right now? No. I'm still just on onions. Which are good. Good stuff. I'm fine. Just can't do anything. Good to hear. Good to hear. As far as we're very slowly doing stuff. I've been painting the 6x8 scenery for three weeks straight. Finished today. My arm and back is very tired. And you gotta put your back into it. Which is to say, I don't know, sit on the painting. 12% remain, everybody. One of these days, we'll finish with this game, and that's going to be a really nice day. Let me tell you. Right now, though, it's not very nice. I've been going for almost two hours, and still... I can't believe it's just like, you know, I'm doing like two hours a day, and it's still not done yet. Hey, it's me. Help, help. It's me. My rat, whatever. I'm sick of dialogue. Find a sister in Furugawa. 
I don't want to talk anymore. I just want to finish the game. <laughs> <sighs> yep. I avoid sitting on the painting. My knee gave up. Ah, fair enough. Wait, what? I don't know what that means. I don't know what any of this means. Tell, explain it to me in excruciating detail. Plant strawberries. Strawberries are not something you plant. They're harvestable things. They're foraging. It's like telling me to go like, oh, plant some plant some wild horseradish in Stardew Valley or something. It's not how that works. They are a forageable objects only. Strawberries are in the Furugawa region. So we're gonna do that. Let me go see real quick. Do I have any I mean that seems to be <clears throat> No. Uh, does work for them. Got that one. Got that one. Tomato squeeze. Talk to a courier in bottom line. I need tomatoes instead of lemons. Okay, that might. I think that's one that I mean. Oh yeah. Well, I mean, I guess I have that stuff, right? I should. Uh, okay, so there's two things I see here. I already got that. Obscure canopy. Okay, uh, get the required account. This is the we'll improvement. Okay, okay. It looks like I have two more side quests to do. Gotta be more 17 seeds per strawberry, but I can't grow them. My boat is extremely inhospitable to, to growing strawberries. I think it's the most obvious thing. I mean, things like that make me not like this game. Books made of brass, forged strawberries. What sort of what sort of wacky wacky type of uh, surrealist painting is this game? I guess I'll hug the cat or something. It's been a little while since I've done that. Really, this depicts a world of horrors beyond imagining. Truly. I can't, I literally can't imagine them. That's how beyond imagining they are. A seal, it talks. It talks and teleports you. What's up with that? It's terrifying. I am literally terrified by this concept. You can't hear it in my voice because I've been so numb. I've I've become so numb by this game. You understand the reference that I was making. The hit, uh, the hit, the hit uh, song from Abraham Lincoln Park called "Numb." I actually don't know if Abraham Lincoln Park made that song or not. There's somebody else. Yo, second guy, tell me, does that does that Lincoln Park that made "Numb"? I guess I could look that up. They did. Okay. <laughs> really shit on the reference by pointing out that it's a reference. Yeah, well, do you know what point in the game we're at right now? This is the point in time where I just say the thing. I think it was the Lincoln, Lincoln Park. It's pronounced Lincoln. Well, frankly, I have no respect for Mike Shinoda or the other guy, so I, I do. It's, there's no reason not to have respect for them. As far as I know, at least. But, uh... I don't know. Is there any reason I shouldn't respect Mike Shinoda? I kind of like Rising Tides. That was a, good, that was a decent album. 100% reason to remember the name. That's what they say. That's what he said, at least. You know. Any questions? Okay, good. Alright! And now, we're gonna go continue on with this. Hi there. Hello. I live a sinful life. You sure do. Are you the one? Thank you again for your time. Okay. Poggers. Which one do you want? Are you the sister? No. Are... 
Find his sister in Furagawa. Here is you. Oh dear. Okay, cool. All right. Talk to Simon again, because this is a never-ending nightmare that will never end. How many more Linkin Park songs can you name? I can name one. And it's the Trying Hard song. The song where Linkin Park tries hard, fails. Wait, did they fail in that song? I don't remember. Probably. <laughs> Why else would it be a song then? The greatest rap rock group of the 2000s. What's it called? I don't, I don't know. None of them knew they were robots. That's what it was called. In the end. I don't know what it was called in the end. And they're coming up with all sorts of names for baseball players these days. <laughs> so, music video. I remember that when I was looking up um, Billy Idol's White Wedding. The first the first video that I found was an... Well, it wasn't even an anime music video. It was made of cutscenes from the Final Fantasy VII movie, I think. Which I guess you could call that an anime cutscene. But, uh, yeah, set to Billy Idol's White Wedding. It, like, wasn't very good. But that's just, that's my uh, entire experience with anime music videos. The end. I think that, that, I think that's a very typical experience of anime music videos, right? How many Billy Idol songs can you name? Got, uh... You know, like, White Whiting. I like, I like, uh... Eyes Without a Face. That's a good one. That's the one where there's eyes and they ain't got no face. Really into it. Felt like it was truly some... Of, some of the peak eye and face related content since since the sledgehammer music video where where Peter Gabriel's Peter Gabriel's face turned into a bunch of fruits and sang about how he likes to fuck I think yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what that song was about Lincoln Park <laughs> anime music video just the last few neurons firing <laughs> before I'm thrown into the soul gate I'm just like Stella Stella do you remember did Linkin Park ever do any sort of collabs with Brian Eno? Anyway, I'm gonna go become a constellation now. <laughs> I feel like they'd probably work together, even if it was just like a like a like a label mandated thing at some point in time. Anyway, I'm also really into Vore! Ah! <laughs> Why am I yelling? It's not painful. <laughs> Okay, n now what? Well, wake me up. Wake me up inside. Can't wake up. Save me from the nothing I've become. I feel like we reference that pretty much every time I do a series with second guy. Right? <laughs> that comes up pretty regularly. Did Forrest Gump talk about rap rock groups? Life is like a box of Limp Biscuit albums. You never know if you're gonna get brake stuff or or air raid vehicle. And that's why I ran so much in that movie because I did it all for the nookie. Have I gotten another percent yet? <laughs> I haven't! <laughs> oh, fuck. Still going, everybody. I mean, it's not even, it wasn't even an anime music video I watched. It was a, 
It, was, uh, it wasn't even an anime music video I watched. It was a um, movie, video game movie music video. If you think about it, is that better or worse? Or about the same? Answer me this question one. <laughs> How do you get these final percentages? Um, anyway. How? Fred Durst. He's a guy. He's a man that exists in the real world. Until he dies, he gets shoved through the Everdor to become a constellation. A constellation of a limp biscuit. And before he does that, he's like, Stella, I'm really into Vor. Me, Fred Durst. This is not slander. This is not libel. It's not libel if it's literally the truth that Fred Durst is into Vor. He loves Vor. And if Fred Durst wants to contest that, he can come on my stream at any point in time. It's open 24 hours a day. Call me at any point in time, Mr. Durst, and we will talk about about your how you do or do not like Vor. Please don't sue me, though. I have no money. <laughs> Took a break from terms to tell you the Limp Bizkit Forest Gump is God tier. No, it's not. Don't. No, don't. Don't. Don't say it's good. None of this is good. This is. This is literally. This is like Who's Afraid of Virginia Wolf style stream of consciousness commentary of the worst kind you can't see it but my head is like tilted at a 45 degree angle because I'm about to fall asleep on my own shoulder poggers please <laughs> nothing that was the sound of me voring um anyway <sighs> I think you're conflating Peter Gra Gabriel with David Byrne and remember bring burning down the house pop-up video as Sledgehammer? I made the mistake five years ago. My life in the bush of ghosts, burning down the bush, bush whacked. I like, I always listen to Mea Culpa off of my life in the bush of ghosts. That's a good track off of that album. Very weird. But I mean, it's David Byrne uh, with... David Byrne with uh, Brian Eno, you kind of expect that sort of people that, that, that tell you how they're moving to a city and also making space music or whatever. I like the album art for space music. That was a good one. Anyway, um, no, it's definitely, no, no, about halfway, okay, okay, about halfway through the, the music video for Sledgehammer, Peter Gabriel's face does indeed turn into a bunch of fruits and vegetables and start singing about fucking people. Trust me, I, I am like, I'm not the foremost, I'm not the foremost authority or anything on Peter Gabriel and his incredible works, like the great album So, or any of the time that he spent in Genesis. But I do, I am very certain of the events of the Sledgehammer music video. Trust me on this one. Look, I wanna, I'll, 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 I'll put this, I will put this to a test right now. If anybody else in chat, do you want to test my knowledge on the Peter Gabriel music video for the song Sledgehammer? I will pass any and all questions that you are given to me with colors most flying. These colors, they're going to be all around the room, circling around you, closing in on you, if you will. As if they have been... Oh, uh, what are the lyrics said? The 123 mark? Uh, you, be your sledgehammer if you just call my name. And what is the name of Peter Gabriel, chat? Do you know? Could you solve my riddle one? That sounds like a lie. Now, here's the thing. How would you know 
See, it's because you don't. This is why I am the foremost Peter Gabriel sledgehammer, stop motion sledgehammer music video uh, scholar in this chat and stream. See? It might sound like a lie, but it doesn't feel like a lie. Calling in the air tonight. Oh, Lord. Think about that. Scholar of the first Peter Gabriel sledgehammer. <laughs> yeah, for the uh, for the Doctor Inferno Firebird game, um, I guess the Peter Gabriel sledgehammer is going to be whatever character's weapon that ends up getting in there. Their, their move set, of course, is going to be uh, hug. Um... It was a broom handle to cram somebody, to cram the opponent into the soul hole. And, uh, remind, remind you that Spirit Fairer is 40 hours long. And that, that, that doesn't make you take physical damage, it just makes you take psychic damage. It takes damage, you take damage nonetheless. Would it just be Stella? Would the character be Stella, or would it be like... Which character from this would be in the Doctor Infernal Firebird fighting game? <laughs> Two percentage points. <laughs> it'll be alongside, it'll be one of the more abstract characters alongside the four times speed uh, button in, in Final Fantasy XII. You know. That's how that works. Now I need to go over to Grey Overcoat or whatever. <laughs> what am I even doing at this point in time? What am I even doing? Lily. Lily, you're still alive. Please live life to your fullest. Don't play Spirit Fair. You will be trapped in the hell of two percents. Extremely 1984 voice. Literally 1984. Literally 19. Literally 19. Literally 1980. Literally 19. Literally 1984 voice. Literally 1984 voice. Okay, I actually need to sleep. Yes. Sleep. What dreams may come? Dreams of spirit fare. And the fairing of spirits. This is the only thing that... You can dream about and will. Obscure canopy. 98 is the only percent. It's like 98 degrees, another one of the hit early 2000 bands. And I mostly remember for once judging people on the televisual show. America's Got Talent? What is it called? What is it what is the game called? No, what is the show called? The Audition? Um Survivor? No. What's the one where people sing a lot? The voice? No, the older one where people sing a lot, because this is early two thousands. <laughs> You know the one where the one where they sing. I'll still parsnips, carrots, and onions and a pepper. I feel like you're making more progress than I am at this point in time making your making your food. When are you free to leave this game? Once I get one hundred. Once it says one hundred percent. Hey, hey, look everybody, look at the background. That tree's floating in the air. Fix your game, Kalu and Knights or whatever. The Thunder Lotus. Berries. You gotta get those berries. I got an orchard upgrade. Is that enough to give me two percentage points? It is not. It's not. It's not gonna be. <laughs> I'm gonna try it! I'm gonna try anyway. Aluminium ringa. I am trapped by this game. My soul is in prison until I get 100%, and that's not happening. 
What's the show called where they sing? I'm gonna look this up right now. Uh, telephone. Uh, television show where they sing. No, it's not the voice. Stop saying the voice. Oh, American Idol. It's called American Idol. It was American Idol. There you go. Oh, why did why is the voice completely taken over for American Idol at this point in time? That's weird to me. I mean, it's not that weird. But it's like slightly weird. It's the one where they're where they're idols and they're American. Yes, the amazing race. The one where they sing a lot, you know. The race one. The one about races. The one about racists. That's what the amazing race is about. This is not slander. Much like Fred Durst, I'm not slandering anybody. And I refuse to believe that you believe that I was trying to slander anybody. Picking fruit all day now! No, I won't. I'll be picking nothing. Well, is there another percentage point? <laughs> 